Hello there, my name is Peter, I'm the web developer and the owner of the company WebAcom. Today we'll be exploring how we can quickly and easily create pop-ups within the new website. We're going to be using something that's called Pop-Up Maker. Today we'll be working on a website, Apex Therapeutics. If you're looking for CBD products, they'll probably be, be your best uh, source for that. So let's head on over to Plugins and we're going to install Pop-Up Maker. Plugins add new going to search for pop-up maker <clears throat> that's the uh, plugin that we want to install we click install and then we'll click activate excellent so to make a pop-up um, it's fairly quick and easy we're just going to head over to our pop-up maker which should be here if it doesn't appear just refresh your page and it should appear within your um oh there it is pop-up maker I'm going to click that and then we're going to skip door um we're going to create a pop-up so we'll call it welcome here we're going to give it a title um let's do h1 welcome to apex so basically this pop-up will ask user if they are over or 18 are you over 18 again i'm going to modify this uh, so it looks really nice um, moments later right now we're just building a very simple pop-up to make sure that it works over here within the triggers section we're going to add a new trigger and it's going to open it automatically after a certain period of time after the page loads and then we're also going to incorporate a small cookie to make sure that if a person revisits the page it doesn't keep on showing that pop-up on the home page every time somebody comes back to the home page and we want to display the pop-up after half a second after the page has loaded I'm going to add that you can see that it has added event of um, the cookie then we're going to be targeting um, targeting is where you want the thing to show we want it shown home page game okay. you can also disable it on mobile devices or tablet devices we're just going to leave it as is right now going to display it now you can uh, select a specific location where you want it to show i want it to be on the home page uh, in the middle and then within the appearance i'm just going to go with um, enterprise blue so this is different um, themes of how to how it's going to look you can definitely customize it and we'll probably do that in the second part of this video so you can set the size <clears throat> and all of the other cool things animations position advanced i think we're done uh here really um it's going to close and and that's it let's click publish so as you see we have specified that it's going to show up and it's going to say welcome to apex and it's going to ask you if it's if you're over 18. this is our apex therapeutics we're going to refresh the page now and we should see the pop-up there we go welcome to apex are you over 18. you see how it's very difficult to read this text so that's how you create a very basic simple pop-up it can be a form it can be a simple message it can have different uh, buttons here so this concludes this small video you have now uh, mastered how to create a small pop-up you can uh, also play around with it add different elements to it um, and in the next video and i'm going to link to link it to this video we're going to dive deeper into how to actually format the pop-up and how to make it really beautiful we're going to be doing some coding we'll be doing um some bootstrap work and custom layouts so if you're more of a tech savvy uh, developer please watch the next uh, video series hopefully this was informative and um, wish you all the best 
Now, before we depart, I want to give you a quick overview about something. We have um, something called acfboot.com. It's a website that we have developed and it allows us to store different elements that we have uh, worked with and that we have used uh, to build clients' websites. I'm going to log in with my credentials here so I can show you how that works. If you are a developer and if you are building websites for clients, I think this would be uh, a very important element that you can use to assemble websites quickly uh, by using the scripts that we have accumulated throughout the years of development work you can fairly quickly and easily assemble complex websites that have many different structures and elements for example tanyasmassagetherapy.com if you look at this section over here bc8 therapists you can see that this section is right here and it has really cool animations that you can actually call out and there is a really cool pop-ups uh, models that come up everything is integrated with advanced custom fields so to use that towards your website you can just download json file it will open up uh, and upload all of the uh, all of the uh, advanced custom fields uh, fields within your wordpress and uh, you upload HTML to your page template and you upload CSS into your CSS folder and you have this beautiful block that you can work with and modify to your customers needs. So that's pretty much how really expensive websites are developed. Um, and I would invite you to just look at this library. I mean, uh, it's a really, really good project. Uh, if you want to join, you can join now by clicking this link. It's one dollar per first month, and then it's four ninety nine uh, each month ever after. Uh, but the prices will go up uh, soon once we collect more blocks. Thanks. If you like this video, please click a like like button, and if it was helpful, please also leave a small comment. Say something like "Thanks, that was really cool." Um, it will really help my channel grow within the YouTube. Alright, thanks and have a good day.